Okay, so we start with the meaning of puberty. Puberty is a process. It is a process that takes place, a stage of growth that occurs in humans between the ages around 11 to 14. Girls start puberty at around age 11 to 13. And for males, males tend to start their puberty a bit later. But these are not fixed. These are just what we estimate to be the average in our current population. It is possible for males to start puberty earlier than 12 years of age or after 14, for example. Okay, so what is puberty about? It is where the reproductive organs of the person starts to develop and this is most noticeable in the amount of hormones they start to produce. The gonads, the testes in the male and the ovaries in the female produce what we call sex hormones. The sex hormones are testosterone, estrogen and progesterone. Now all humans after puberty will have these hormones regardless of whether they are male or female but the difference is in what levels of the hormone would be higher in a boy or in a girl. In males, boys, testosterone is much higher. In a male, the levels of testosterone start to increase and this will kickstart the development of secondary sexual characteristics. The development of this is seen mostly in the physical body, quite clearly in the shoulders, grows wider, the shoulders grow wider, the body becomes more muscular or is more easy for a male to put on muscle mass. The growth of facial hair and also the growth of hair in the axilla, meaning the armpits, groin, legs, chest, and also the growth of the voice box, also known as the larynx or the Adam's apple. This makes the voice of a male start to deepen. And in that process, the rapid growth of the voice box may cause the boy's voice to crack. This is when the mind or rather the body of the person is not yet used to a larger larynx and the associated growth of the entire apparatus around it, including the vocal cords. So it takes a bit of time for the person to get used to this new body. And in that time, voice may crack because they can't really control the larynx or the vocal cords very well. In terms of females, breasts will grow and also the hip becomes wider, the hip bone becomes wider. Hair also grows, but not generally on the face, but in the armpits, yes, there's also growth of hair in the groin area, the pubic hair. Now, for the male sex hormones, they also start to rise so high and it kickstarts the production of sperm cells. Sperm cells are developed in the testes and these are what we call the male sex cells. The high levels of testosterone will help the testes produce sperm cells. The sperm cells are produced in the testes in the female. The menstrual cycle begins and mature ova will be released from either ovary once per menstrual cycle. The menstrual cycle is said to begin with menstruation. Menstruation is generally taken to be the beginning of each menstrual cycle. Menstruation is where the uterine lining within the body breaks down and passes out through the vagina. And this is regulated by the estrogen and progesterone hormones.